Hello everyone, I'm Kili with Leodani Ukulele. And for all of you who subscribed to us and saw us last week in our first video, I want to thank you and you know we really appreciate you guys watching us and learning about the ukulele through us. And so like always in the comment section below, just ask us any question you want to ask and we'll try to answer it for you in future videos. But today's topic is going to be about ukulele sizes. And so we're just going to tackle the three most common sizes, the soprano, the concert, and tenor. And we'll save the baritone uh, size for a whole nother video because that's a whole nother beast to deal with. So first off, we have our standard size or the soprano size and it's the smallest ukulele size out there. And so with it being so small, what you're going to have come out of this ukulele is a very bright and happy sound. Very high in pitch and very bright and happy. So here's a sound sample of a soprano or standard ukulele. <laughs> Its bigger brother is the concert ukulele. So here is the size of the concert ukulele. So right off the bat, you can see that the neck is longer and the body is wider and more round. So here is the size comparison between the standard soprano ukulele and the concert ukulele. So with the concert ukulele having a, a longer body and a very long and, and, and more wide body, what's going to happen is the sound that comes out of the concert ukulele is going to be deeper and rich. So it'll still have a little bit of that happy, bright, bell-like sound of the soprano ukulele, but it's going to gain warmth and richness in tone. So here is a sound sample of a concert ukulele. <laughs> As you can tell, it's a little more fuller in sound because the body is larger. So keep in mind that when you buy ukulele sizes, make sure that you know that you know, your body size will also be in consideration to the size of the ukulele body. So make sure that you can be able to grab it. So for standard ukulele, it's kind of small, so it might be harder to, to hold under your arm. But as the bigger you get, the bigger the body gets, the easier it is to hold. So next we have its oldest brother and the big boy of the bunch, and this is the tenor ukulele. So obviously, as you can tell, this bugger is big, right? So with the size comparison with the concert ukulele, you're going to see the difference here. So longer neck and longer and wider body. So what this does for the sound of the tenor ukulele is it brings out the bass of the ukulele. So you're going to lose the, the high, the bright, and the, and the more happy sound of the tenor um, of the soprano, but you're going to gain the rich, low, deep bass of this ukulele, of the tenor size. So here's a sound sample of the tenor ukulele. So right off the bat, you can notice that it's very deep, very rich, and very low. So a very bassy ukulele. And so, which one should I get if I'm a beginner? Well, if you're a guitar player learning how to play the ukulele, I would recommend getting the tenor size. Why? It's not such a small jump down to the soprano size right here. And so if you're playing the guitar and you love playing the guitar but you want to learn ukulele, I recommend getting the tenor. So you're going to keep having that, that, that high string um, tension and a really deep mellow and rich bass notes. And so the size also is more comfortable when you start learning how to play this one. For beginners, if you're young, I would recommend getting the soprano ukulele. It's smaller and it's easy to learn on. The strings are not as tight because the length from nut to saddle is not that far apart. And so it's easy to learn on a standard ukulele. So if you're young and you're just beginning, I'd get the standard ukulele. And if you want to compromise between the best of both worlds, having a happy, bright sounding ukulele with some warm and richness, I'd get the concert ukulele. So right in the middle. So for me, when I learned ukulele, I learned on the concert ukulele right size just for my body, my profile. And so there you have it, the three different sizes of the ukulele. And so like always, rate us, subscribe to us, and, and write your comments below, and we'll check it out, and we'll see you here next week. So ukulele players out there, keep jamming, and aloha.